البحث عن الفندق الملائم لقضاء رحلة عمل أو لقضاء الإجازة الصيفية أمر مرهق جدا لا سيما إذا كانت المنطقة مليئة بمختلف أنواع الفنادق الراقية ففي المدن التي تكثر فيها الفنادق المتنوعة لجذب الزفوس ذروته في تقديم الفخامة والخدمة المتميزة وأحد أهم عناصر الضيافة لدى الفنادق والذي يكلف كثيرا ويصعب تحقيقه هو تقديم مستوى عال من النظافة وخاصة فيما يخص الأجواء الداخلية عندما يتم توفير هواء تكييف نقي وصحي نحن في حدثنا ثورة في عالم أنظمة التكييف وذلك بابتكار تقنيات لم يسبق إليها تساعد على توفير طاقة التكييف وجعله أكثر فعالية وكفاءة مع توفير أعلى درجات الراحة ها نحن نقدم لكم التقنية التي طال انتظارها في مجال التكييف وقد تم تسميتها لينرجي اول فريش اير والتي تعني تكييف بطاقة منخفضة وتهوية كاملة 100% هواء خارجي متجدد كما ان التكييف بتقنية ليفا يخفض 90% من فاتورة صيانة تكييف الفنادق او غيرها تقنية ليفا تفتخر بميزتها الفريدة بما توفره متجدد 100% وذلك لكل غرفة ومكان بالمبنى ونفس الهواء الخارجي يتم تنقيته عبر مروره بفلاتر من نوع هيبا فلتر المخصصة والمستخدمة في المستشفيات وغرف العمليات لتوفير الأجواء الصحية على العكس من التكييف بالنظام الحالي فإن التكييف بنظام برجوع هواء المبنى إلى المكيف وتدويره لذا فإن نظام ليفا يعتمد نظام دائرة الهواء المفتوحة بحيث في كل مرة يأتي هواء جديد للمكيف يتم تنقيته بالفلاتر من الغبار وبالتالي هواء المكيف بنظام ليفا لا ينقل أي غبار ولا حتى الرائحة أخرى أو من مكان لآخر الإجراءات الخاصة بتجهيزات غرف النزلاء في الفنادق الخمسة نجوم تحرص على التنظيف الشامل للغرفة ومحتوياتها دون الاكتراث بتنظيف ممرات الهواء التي تحتوي على هواء ملوث لطالما تم تدويره ويبقى داخل المكيف عندما يتلقاه النزيل الجديد نظام ليفا هو الحل الوحيد لهذه المشكلة والذي يوفر هواء جديدا للنزيل القادم بالإضافة إلى هواء متجدد لنفس النزيل خلال فترة إقامته وهذا يساعد على طرد الروائح الكريهة كالتدخين داخل الغرف وغيره في دقائق معدودة فيجعل الفندق بدرجة من النظافة تستحق أن تكون درجة سبعة نجوم لتوفر الأجواء الصحية فيه مبدأ تقنية ليفا هو أن مسكن الإنسان يستحق تهوية متجددة Less Energy, All Fresh Air, LIFA Air Conditioning Technology is a registered invention under air distribution method for air conditioning, using 100% fresh air to cool buildings. The invention is registered as patented and filed in Malaysia, Saudi Arabia, and USA. Now, in this video, the presentation will cover how LIFA's concept works and how it can save energy while using a 100% fresh air to air condition the building. This video is representing the actual experiment for working model that was conducted in LIFA Living Lab located at Jeddah City, Saudi Arabia. What you are seeing in this slide is a simulation of an actual air conditioned zone covered by 5 ton 60,000 BTUH air conditioning unit. The arrangement represents the current air conditioning system with 0% fresh air where it depends on closed air cycle. In the room, the cold air is supplied with flow rate of 2,000 cubic feet per minute and temperature at supply grill equal 55 degrees Fahrenheit. The same flow rate of air is going to leave the room as return air to the AC unit, but with higher temperature matching the room set temperature. If we plug in the figures for the room energy equation, then the room load will be 43,000 BTUH. If we follow the return air back to the AC unit, it will enter the AC coil with 78 degrees Fahrenheit, raised by 3 degrees from the duct and ceiling. Now by applying the AC unit energy equation, the load across the cooling coil will be 49,000 BTUH. Now let's see what happens when LIFA system concept of open air cycle is used to air condition and cool the same zone. In the room, the cold air is supplied from the AC unit at flow rate of 1500 cubic feet per minute. 20% of the supply air will leave the room as exhaust. 
This will create positive cold air offset in the room. Now here's the great benefit where the cold air starts to push against the external wall, preventing the external heat load from getting into the room. As a result, formation of hot air film starts moving up beside the wall, flushing out the heat through the exhaust. This phenomena allows LEFA system to cool the room with higher supply grill temperature of 60 degrees Fahrenheit as calculated from the room energy equation. Moreover, the supply airflow rate is also lowered by 25%. Back to the AC unit. LEFA pre-cooling filter and energy box manage to drop the fresh air temperature from 95 degrees to 78 degrees Fahrenheit. This is due to energy gaining from circulating portion of the supply air and by the cooling effect of condensate water. In LEFA pre-cooling device, the heat exchange depends on two free energy sources. First, heat of condensation of fresh air over the condensate water. Second, heat of fusion of condensate water over ice making coil device. If we plug the figures in the AC energy equation, then the AC unit load over its cooling coil will be 43,000 BTUH. Now this shows that LEFA technology can cool the building with 100% fresh air and less energy than any current AC system using 0% of fresh air. Our living lab working model research conclusion is, LEFA technology is a proven technology that will resolve the two major shortfalls of the current air conditioning system design. These two shortfalls are polluted indoor air quality from closed air cycle and building's air circulation. Indoor pollution. How to protect yourself from indoor air pollutants. Warning. Silent killers in your house. The EPA, US Environmental Protection Agency, has published some really scary statistics concerning indoor air pollution. Here are some of the facts. Indoor air can be two to five times more polluted than the air outside your house. Some World Health Care organizations even raise this number to 100 times. 3,000 cases of cancer in USA are caused by exposure to indoor air pollutants every year. 50% of all illnesses are caused or aggravated by polluted indoor air. 90% of colds and flus are caught indoors and only 10% outdoors. Carbon monoxide is the leading cause of accidental poison deaths in North America. You certainly don't want to become a part of these scary statistics. So what can we do to avoid it? First of all, we need to understand what these airborne pollutants are, and where they come from. And second, eliminate the pollution sources if possible. And neutralize the pollution itself. The most popular indoor air pollutant types are dust, mold spores, pollen, dust mites, pet dander, bacteria and viruses, carbon monoxide, odors, pesticides, household cleaners, exhaustion fumes, smoke, lead, asbestos, what can we do to protect ourselves from them? First, use non-toxic cleaning products. Almost all household cleaning products use VOCs, volatile organic compounds. Read labels, watch out for benzene, methylene chloride and perchlorothalene, ammonia, chlorine, petroleum-based chemicals, carefully follow the instructions. Make your own cleaning products from non-toxic ingredients. Most of them are easy to make and are not less effective than their manufactured counterparts. You may consider using homemade cleaning alternatives. Baking soda. Vinegar. Cream of tartar. Lemon juice. Borax. These products will help you in your cleaning and polishing chores, add freshness, remove odors without leaving harmful substances behind. Second, take advantage from indoor plants. Indoor plants clean air naturally and return oxygen into the air. 
plants regulate air humidity, eliminate toxins, even filter chemicals. Bear in mind that leafy plants are most effective for indoor air purification. NASA and the Associated Landscape Contractors of America have announced a list of plants that are most effective for indoor air purification. They are Erica Palm Boston Fern Peace Lily Reed Palm Weeping Fig Janet Craig Dracaena English Ivy Pygmy Date Palm Rubber Plant and Aloe Vera Third, air your house regularly. This is the most effective way of